Most people agree. Our world cannot continue on its trajectory of self-destruction. We need a new model, which I'm going to propose over the next few videos. Things have changed. We do not believe the same way we did a few centuries ago. Newton talked about matter. We now know we are not matter. We are just energy. We live in a holographic universe. When we change something here, it changes over there too. We are holograms. A totally new way of thinking, of seeing ourselves. Our minds can neither understand creation nor infinity. The creator in some American Indian tribes is called Wankantanka, meaning the great mystery. It is a great mystery. Our little human minds cannot understand the great mysteries, but we're getting a little closer every day with each new scientific discoveries, which is eventually going to cross path with philosophy. Take the Higgs boson, for example, discovered in August 2012. We knew it existed, but it was finally discovered scientifically. What is the Higgs boson? Well, if you take an atom and keep cutting it, cutting it, cutting it, getting smaller and smaller, eventually you get to that particle called the God particle, the adamantine particle, or Higgs boson. It is the smallest particle you can get to, and the particle actually creates matter. And according to some philosopher, spiritual leaders, that particle can be commanded with love. We cannot control our universe, but we can command these particles with love, which creates a whole new world, a bright future. And this is going to be the subject of my key number five, living happy and healthy on planet Earth. I'll see you soon.